Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Tostitos Hint of Guacamole. And I have the Roll Gold uh, recipe number four, the uh, Zesty Buffalo. The uh, recipe number four was four. 448 at Walmart. I the, wrote it. The Tostitos on. was 349 at Kroger. So I got Dr. Payne writing. Just not the pay. <laughs> Isn't that the truth? Uh uh da, 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 da. hint of guacamole, meats, tasty salsa. Oh, because they're showing you salsa at the bottom. Okay. Uh we're about to walk your world. Uh, about 20 chips is 150 calories. You know, I never, I never, I never ate guacamole because I don't, I don't mind the flavor of it. You can go ahead. I don't mind the flavor of it. I, I don't like it being cold. I never wanted to dip uh, chips in, in cold stuff. It's just me. Mm. I like the flavor. It's a um, it uh, has a spiciness to it. It does have a little spice though. Like a little um, like a pepper spice. Like a red pepper or something. Those are I like I love the flavor of them. In all honesty, one hundred percent honest, I thought I'm gonna hate those. They're green. Yeah, we guacamole. don't eat green stuff. Either. We don't. We don't. Well, I, I don't eat guacamole. No, I'm just kidding. And we do eat green stuff, but we don't eat guacamole. And I truly, with all my heart, thought I'm gonna buy these and do a review of them. But I'm gonna hate them. I love them. Yeah, they're very, very good. It is spicy. It, there is some well, there spice. Are, it says it's got jalapeno pepper in there. That's one of the higher ingredients, actually. I don't even see where it says it has. I could eat that all day long. Isn't guacamole avocado? I know, and I don't like avocado. I don't I, even see the word avocado why. written in here. That's why I thought I was gonna hate them because I don't like avocado. And like when we go to like the Cheesecake Factory, they have this big salad that I like, but it comes with like a half of an avocado on the box. I tell them, hold the avocado. I don't want it because uh, I can't stand them. So this, that's well, they're why, usually cold too. That's why I thought I'm not going to like these at all because I thought it was gonna taste like avocado and it doesn't. No. It just has a very uh, spicy um, pepper. Yeah, like a green. Well, it's jalapeno. Yeah, it's, um, it's I like I'm even lot. gonna be 100% more honest. Um, these taste more like a salsa. Yes, they do. They don't taste like guacamole at all. Yeah. That, that, see, because I don't eat guacamole. That's what I'm saying. I don't eat it because I normally don't. I've had it before and I hate it. I can't stand it. I can't stand avocado and I can't usually stand guacamole. Well, there's no, and there's no, there's no avocado or anything like that and that's in why the ingredients list. That's why they're successful for yeah. me. That's, so, if you are looking for a real guacamole flavor, you're not getting it a right. real avocado flavor, you're not going to get it from these. Because no. Because <laughs> I would have never liked them if they had that in there. Yeah, no, truly, these are like a, a salsa. And they're awesome, though. Because I have a I have somebody at work that used to make his own salsa at home. This tastes just like oh, it his is. salsa. Yes, and he made like chunky with chunky um, tomato and onion, mm -hmm. and it was really good. Yeah, but, but you're that, right. It, it tastes really just like that. It's like it's all pepper and not a whole lot of tomato or anything like yeah. that. It's all peppery kind of flavor. Mm -hmm. That's what that tastes like. Yeah. It's good though. Yeah, very, very, very good. That the the biggest surprise of the month is yeah. right there. Because you could try bag. those without you even need salsa dip them in. You just That's, eat the yeah, you could save your money. Uh, they're losing money from their salsa because you don't need it at you all with it. this. All you almost be do, overload. Yeah, all you have to do is buy a bag of these and you'd be set. Yeah. So save yourself uh, two fifty. Um, and these are the rolled gold recipe number four zesty buffalo. And like I said, we had these at our Walmart, which was a big surprise because uh, when we tried the recipe number five, it's not something that they had at Walmart. Mm -hmm. And now they're starting to sell both of these, so which is interesting. I like the twists. Rolled Gold has always been good at pretzels, but thanks to our new Innovation Kitchen, we're also great at flavor, and we've got a new line of flavor recipes to prove it. This is recipe number four, and these twists are full of delicious, zesty buffalo flavor. 
14 pretzels are 130 calories. That's not bad. How many good? 13? 14. 14. Oh, they're softer than I thought. They're very soft. They're not as crispy. They're almost like a breadstick. One thing. Mm hmm They got some spice though in the back. Cayenne pepper sauce. Yeah. Cayenne red peppers. Yes. Definitely have some meat. Of course, if you're eating buffalo, of course, you would expect. Onion powder, it. citric acid, garlic powder, spices, paprika extracts. I taste garlic and onion too. These are made by Frito Lay in uh, Texas. I got garlic, onion, a peppery flavor. A little bit of that vinegariness you get from a buffalo yeah, sauce. Yeah, they have the vinegar. Um, it tastes like buffalo. If you've had buffalo wings, yeah. that buffalo sauce, that's exactly what they taste like. Yeah, except some of the some of the garlic and onion is coming through a little bit more than you get with a lot of buffalo sauces. These, I like those. These are actually very um, pleasurable to eat mm -hmm. because they're soft. Like I said, they're more like a breadstick than a. They really are. Uh, because you look at them and you, and to fill them in the bag, you would think these are going to be hard, very crispy pretzels. Mm -hmm. They're not. No. So if you don't like chewing on hard things and you like, you need to like buffalo, but these would be excellent for you to try yeah. because they're so good. And they have a nice spice, a pleasurable spice that you get flavor. And a little heat to back it up. It's not one of these all hot to be hot kind of things. No, not at all. It's got heat, but it's a it's a nice you but can enjoy. But it has enjoy flavor it. to it as yeah, well. Those the, are really the good. Vinegar and the spices. Um, I think both these are excellent. But you can only afford. You can only afford one. Um. Probably the guacamole. That would be mine too. But well, I'm telling you, Ed, it's the big. Just because for us. I like this is a more pleasurable experience for me. This crunchiness of that corn kind of tortilla flavor. Mm -hmm. um, I like that. I like that flavor of the underlying corn. Mm -hmm. Although, if I'm buying them in the store, either one of these would be good. Oh yeah. I mean, they're both excellent products. Yes. Now, my question: If you've had the guacamole, if you've tried them, and you felt the same way we did. Maybe you love guacamole, and so you bought those hoping they would taste like guacamole. Or maybe you think they taste like guacamole. Yeah, tell us what you think, because I've had guacamole, and it was like, okay, I've tried it, and never again, because I did not like, because I don't like avocado. So, tell us what you thought of these. Did you think it was just like a green pepper like we did? Uh, because truly, yeah, we just didn't get the guacamole. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have a picture of these for you at the end, and thanks for watching.